Hello, this is Lincoln Easley here, and today we're going to be doing Gun Hack of the Week. Today's Gun Hack, we're going to be going over on cleaning synthetic stocks with rubbing alcohol. Rubbing alcohol is a cheap, inexpensive way to go through a clean. You can buy this stuff just about anywhere, and it comes from between a couple bucks to five dollars at the most. So you can't go wrong with this. So what I'm going to do, first things first, we're going to use our 9 mil. We're going to check to see if it's unloaded. If it is unloaded, no magazine. And now to make this work, you're going to go through, take a paper towel. You're going to go through and you're going to rub, rubbing alcohol on your firearm. Just like this. You get it all nice and clean. This will get all the dirt and grime and everything off your firearm. And make sure that there's nothing on there. It's also important to make sure you follow the rules in your firearms when you're clean this make sure you point in a safe direction even though you know it's unloaded so there we go now that it's all done you let it have a let it have a second to dry and now we're going to take a little bit of oil and we're going to rub a little bit of oil on the metal parts to make sure it's all good to go so i'm going to get another towel here so we can just use some of this right here. We're gonna go through and we're gonna rub this all in. This is all gonna re-lubricate our firearm. This will keep it from corroding and rusting. We're gonna go through and do our trigger. And there we go. So now our firearm is all done. It's all lubricated. We uh, had a really good way of getting our gun nice and clean. It's easy to grip now. And there we go. We had gone through and cleaned up our firearm with rubbing alcohol. And my gun is working really good now. And this is one of the gun hacks that you can use to clean your synthetic stocks for your firearms. So, be safe, be happy, and have a really good day just so everybody knows I am not here to show you how to break the laws I'm not showing you what not to do or what to do these are my opinions based off my own research and I am going to continue bringing on more gun hack videos so have a great day be safe and happy shooting